Chapter 1 The Arrival In the velvet tapestry of the cosmos, where stars whispered secrets across light years, a shadow loomed, a vessel unlike any other, its hull glimmering with the mysteries of a thousand worlds. It was the Aylery ship, a marvel of extraterrestrial engineering, silently slicing through the void toward a vibrant blue orb, Earth. Aboard the ship, the air hummed with anticipation. Commander Laris, her skin a tapestry of iridescent scales, stood before the panoramic viewport, her eyes reflecting the planet's azure hue. This, she announced in a voice that resonated through the chamber, is where our journey finds purpose. Her second in command, Talon, a being of towering stature and deep-set luminescent eyes, joined her side. The readings are promising, Commander. This planet teems with life, ripe for our undertaking. Below them, Earth spun in its serene orbit, unaware of the impending convergence of fates. As the ship descended through the atmosphere, cloaked in invisibility, the Alori surveyed the land. Lush forests, sprawling oceans, and towering mountains unfolded beneath them. But it was the primates, creatures of curiosity and agility, that captured their attention. These beings, Lyris mused, hold potential. With our guidance, they could be the key to our salvation. In the ship's genetic laboratory, a hive of activity buzzed into motion. Scientists, their hands deft in the art of genetic manipulation, began the process of altering the very fabric of the primate's DNA. The air was electric with the power of creation, a symphony of science and ambition. As the first of the engineered humans took breath, their eyes opened to a world unknown. They stood, a blend of primal strength and newfound intellect, gazing in wonder at their creators. Lyris addressed them, her voice a melody of authority and benevolence. You are the chosen. Through you, great wonders will be built and through your labor, the stars shall fuel our journey. Among the humans, a figure stepped forward. His eyes, a deep shade of earth, held a spark of unspoken understanding. We are yours to command, he spoke, his voice rough but laced with a newfound purpose. As the Alori began their guidance, teaching and directing the humans in the arts of construction and engineering, the foundations of a great endeavor were laid. The pyramids, destined to be monuments of power and mystery, began to rise from the earth, stone by monumental stone. In the cool embrace of night, as stars twinkled like distant fires, Lyris stood atop the highest pyramid, looking down at the bustling activity below. The air was thick with the scent of earth and sweat, a testament to the humans' relentless toil. Talon joined her, his gaze sweeping across the landscape. They work tirelessly, Commander. The energy nexus will soon be complete. Lyris nodded, her heart a tangle of pride and sorrow. Yes, but at what cost? We have altered their destiny forever. In the quiet that followed, the only sound was the whisper of the wind, a carrier of dreams and echoes of a future yet unwritten. The Alori's mission on Earth was just beginning but the seeds of a story greater than any they had known were already sown. As dawn broke, casting a golden light over the land, the first pyramid neared completion, a testament to the union of two worlds. It was a beacon of hope and power, a bridge between Earth and the stars, and the beginning of a legacy that would echo through the ages.